Hello fellow movie watchers, tis I the Rumpled One, movies I've watched, Cloud Atlas, Halle Berry Tom Hanks, they got a bunch of other uh, top names in here, but I can't figure out why they made this, why they decided to do this film, either they were having fun, or they needed the money. It's not quite a turkey, but it comes close. I leave it up to you. Gonzo, the life and work of Dr. Hunter S. Thompson. Great movie. I think you should watch it. In fact, I know you should watch it. Because it's recent history. In fact, I, I'm ashamed to admit that I didn't know who this guy was. He was a writer that wrote for the Rolling Stone <clears throat> in the 60s and 70s. But see, back then I was still in junior high and high school. I really wasn't that much interested in politics. And I was more interested in playing sports. And then going to college, getting my degree, making money. Really wasn't into politics, but he fills in a lot of blanks. And he, it also goes to show that people knew about Nixon and Bush and all these guys way back then. He, he tried to warn the country. The country didn't listen. I suggest you get it. Day, night, day, night. It's not a great movie. It's about this young girl who's preparing to be a suicide bomber. And it's really not that intense, but it makes you feel uncomfortable. So if you're interested in suicide bombers, I suggest it. Leverage. I didn't know about this TV show, so I tried it out. I like it. Season one. Only problem is... The basic premise is kind of unbelievable. It like works for one or two episodes, but after that, but I still like it and I'll still watch the other seasons. Let's see, the star is uh, Timothy Hutton. Boogeyman, <laughs> turkey alert, big time turkey alert. Don't waste your time. There's nothing scary about this movie at all. Light Keepers. We've got Richard Dreyfuss. Funny movie about this old guy who's at a lighthouse. And the adventures in his life. I liked it. It's enjoyable. The Ninth Gate. Johnny Depp. <coughs> good movie. I liked it. It's uh, Johnny Depp is, I guess you could call him a book detective. Goes out and finds rare books for collectors. And it gets a little out there at the end. <laughs> <laughs> but it's still enjoyable. Oh, Magnum P.I. I don't know what I was thinking. I didn't even bother watching it. But anyway, <clears throat> those are the movies I've watched. Boogeyman Turkey Alert. So I hope you've enjoyed what you've been watching. And once again, I love the comments and the replies. And if you haven't subscribed, please do so. And as always, don't run out of popcorn.